fuck I got to put in your mom jokes or something? <laughs> Nigga, your mom sucked dick for gas station restroom keys. <laughs>
look like a South Park character. <laughs> it's funny. I said fake Jews. Those are my words, right? Yeah. Those are my words. I and yo, I think this nigga to do a business with Lush. I think this nigga is actually a fake Jew. His name is something like Al Alki Alki David or some shit like that. It's something Israeli. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But not Israelite. Talk to him. You see what I said? See how I flipped this? Now we're not even talking about battle rap no more. Let's talk about Syria. <laughs> yeah, yo, that's it for. I think so. I think. And I'm sorry. I really thought we were safe. I thought disaster punch and math gave us some time. I thought, like, all right, niggas go. Like, cannabis. Cannabis gave us some time. If cannabis would have bodied disaster, oh, it would have been a rap right now. Yeah. You know what I mean? But cannabis knew what he was doing. He saved us. Some, that's why he did it. That's why he did it. That I know cannabis. I know. That's it, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's over. I feel like if it's not over, it's going to be... Because now you got niggas... You got different pay scales you're dealing with now, yo. You got your m and that's putting money into it. You know what I mean? You got yeah. this, this fake Jew that's putting money into it. Yeah. You got Snoop, who I guess is putting money into yeah. it. You yeah. know what I mean? You got a lot of big-name niggas now. And, like, so if... Because I think they allegedly disaster is getting 50000 Allegedly, right? Yeah. If they can afford to give Disaster 50000 mm -hmm. what are they going to give Clips? Well, even bigger money come in. When they see that, they, they yeah. see that happen. And then even bigger money come in. They can always do this. Yeah. And then they can drown that, out the real shit. The film on nigga, the nigga who's doing Bitter Lush One, he has his own website. Like, he don't even got to go through a third party. This nigga has his own outlet for streaming. He's already streaming shit. It's like he owns like a Justin TV type shit or something. So he was right when you, you basically had the thought that, you know, it was good for the culture that he punched them, being that you didn't want it to go where it went. But if I forgot who we were dealing with. Yeah. I forgot they like that. Back gotta compete with these niggas. Yeah. He's our only hope now. And I don't think I think he's waiting to get that money too. Like, yeah. I think he'll just accept the buyout just because, you know. Yeah, they, yeah, they have a little smack division of, of film on. That's, that's, no. that's Illuminati right there. That's New, <laughs> that's new World Order of Battle Rap. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, anybody would take a check. They're going to give you stupid money. Yeah. Anybody would take the check, yeah. yeah. yeah I can't blame him for taking that check, but it's no good to come of it. I'm really sad about it. Like, I'm really broken up. I'm so sad. They're going to go get money. That's the good I see out of it. People are going to get paid off. I mean, Hopefully, the right people get paid. It's it's prosper. It's going in a good direction, but at the same time, like you said, the quality might drop. With the money comes in the water. You water it down with money most of the time. That's what happened in hip hop. Like you said, with the nineties, mm -hmm. that was when the money started to yeah. pour into the, the hip hop. Like I said, there's going to be other leagues. There's still going. I'm not saying they're going to take over the game. There's going to be no other leagues, but those leagues are going to be underground. It's good, like like hip hop, like. Everybody in the '90s, everybody was on the radio. It was a very diversified scene on the local radio stations. So you would get your hardcore rap, you get your gangster rap, you get your fucking conscious rap, you get your your, your girls rapping, you get you know I me, mean? you get poppy rap, you get you get everything. You had a cornucopia of different raps to listen to on the radio, and you could choose which avenue you wanted to go down. Now they give you, on the radio nowadays, they give you like three avenues to go down and you gotta, you gotta choose one or you're not cool. That's the way they make it now. That's the way battle rap is going this way. You know what I mean? In the 90s, right now, we have a lot of diversity in battle rap. We have URL, we have King of the Dot, we got I Battle, we got Don't Flop, we got Spit That Heat, we got, you know, mm -hmm. SRL, we got BGV, we got mm -hmm. LOC, we have a lot of different leagues right now. And all those leagues, I'm not saying any of those leagues are going anywhere. You're competing at that level that these niggas are going to be competing at as far as, as far as you know what I mean, what you're willing to pay someone. So when the niggas start getting used to getting 50000 a battle and getting 100000 a battle and getting, it's like, when, now when you go to Smack or when you go to uh, King of the Dot or you go to SRL or you go to one of these other leagues, then fucking, you're not giving your full all because you're not going to get the same payday that you would get. Like how niggas say the URL, that's, it only counts when it's on URL. That money, he's going to try to buy that. Like, you can't copy respect, but you can damn sure buy that motherfucker. Oh, shit. You know what I mean? That's what they're going to do. That's what they coming here to do. <laughs> you think, you, do you think Daylight was right? He said on one of his blogs that the, they, the different leagues need to unite in order to combat. Like, he was just talking about Slaughterhouse. But now, even more.
more so with this other league putting together these big money battles. Like he was saying, like King of the Dot and Smack need to like join forces and unite to. He did say that. Compete. He did say that. Yeah, that's kind of like. Damn, I thought he was bullying. I thought he was, it was just they like joking around, but yeah, and they got there playing flag football with Snoop. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, there's a lot of niggas that stand to make a lot of money. If they, you know, you can buy in now, mm-hmm. buy in right, right, like get in there now, because there's money to be made. Yeah. There's no doubt about that. There is money to be made. Cause these motherfuckers is paying people two hundred and fifty thousand mm. dollars for three rounds. They said it's gonna be two three minute rounds and one minute and one and the third round is gonna be five minutes to unlimited. But Lush one already said he ain't cutting nobody off, so that means unlimited every round. Basically, I think you can get almost anyone in the industry. Well, I ain't gonna say that. Right? You can get that to anybody for two fifty. Two fifty. You can get miles. anybody. Like they fucked up by giving that much to Cassidy. They should have shot a little higher with their two fifty. Yeah. Not saying not to get Cassidy, but they should have like see how much Lil Wayne want, or see how much you know what I mean Drake want, or something like that. You know what I mean? Like yeah. see how much Eminem want. Cause now you to get Cassidy two hundred fifty thousand dollars. That's the benchmark now. I got it. Like, I'm Lil Wayne. I got to get double what Cassidy get because I'm fucking at least maybe triple. You got to give me a million dollars. Like, and you could feasibly probably give him a million dollars and still make money off that battle. Like, that's the crazy thing. But, yeah, you know, a lot of shit is going to be happening, yeah. Because Cassidy, Joe Budden's doing it was one thing, right? Cassidy doing it is another, right? Yeah. But Keith Murray... And Fragile Star, Mike Jones, and Bone Crusher, that's stupid. Because he, you know these niggas ain't getting no types of close to money that yeah. Cassidy is getting. True. You know what I mean? But they're still doing it. So not only is there going to be a lane for these niggas to get hundreds of thousands of dollars a battle, it's also going to be a lane for them lower tier niggas to get booked at MC Wars. And they wrap it over a beat for like two rounds. I think it's only one round oh, in acapella. Shit, right? I think so. I think okay. that's how MC... Uh, that's where Math Alpha Battle K-Shine. Okay. Yeah, oh, okay. I like that, but I, I kind of like that format. I really do. But and that's gonna be the saving grace for all four of them niggas, cause I really don't want to hear none of them off a beat too tough. I don't know what else to say, man. I think that's it. Where they need to hit us at? They need to hit us up on Twitter, yo. Right. At OEP Media. All hit right. me up on Twitter at Rock Raw, my nigga. All right. You know what I'm saying? They get uh, uh drop that top ten. Do it. We we at uh H T T P semicolon backslash backslash www.facebook.com backslash OEP Media O-N-E That's OEP Media 1, man. We here. Uh-huh. You, 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 can, you can like the page. How you doing? And you can drop in there in that inbox or on the wall, however you choose to do it, or on the comment section here, or on Twitter, anywhere in the world you happen to be. What's easiest for you? Drop that top 10. That's top 10 battlers as of right now, today, to you. No judgments. We your your votes are anonymous. We'll add up the talent of votes. You know how we do. We'd have told you before. There's a fucking link right here to All tell right. you how to do it. Alright. Yeah, big dumb dummies. We OEP media, my nigga. This is 30 pages of rhymes, my nigga. You see them fucking cameras and fucking TV screens and shit, nigga? We out here getting money, nigga. We out here getting money, nigga. That shit real, nigga. Nigga, think it's a green screen. I can't afford no green screen, nigga. Yeah. I can afford no TV screens, though, nigga. Yeah. I can afford this ambiance, nigga. Right. What you know yeah. about ambiance, nigga? You know the fuck out of here, nigga. It's rock raw, man. That's my man Goliath, my nigga. We are OEP Media, and this is 30 Pages of Rhymes. I'm they out. They hate us because they ain't us. Could take everything we got and can't break us. I think they hate us because they ain't us. Y'all copy a lot and we create it up. I think they hate us because they hate us. So 